Hi, I'm David with General Air. I get asked a lot, what's the difference between MIG and TIG? Why would I choose one or the other? Well, today I want to show you a project that's perfect for the TIG welding process. It's also great practice for you if you just have started learning TIG welding. I'm going to be making a stainless steel picture frame. And I got this stainless steel tubing out of a scrap bin, and it's fairly thick, so it'll be pretty easy to weld on. We're going to cut it in 45 degree angles and put it together so we just make a little rectangle. And now we have something to practice our TIG welding on and something to hang in our house that looks really cool. I'm going to be using my strong hand rhino cart because it's a really good fixturing table. It's going to be able to hold these two pieces where they need to be. Now that being said, we could just build this on a flat level surface, but it's a little easier just to use the table. Now what we've done is we've cut 45 degree angles in each of the tubes, so now we have a 90 right here. And I'm going to be holding these down with these small clamps. When I do that, I want to make sure my fit up between the pipes are as close as they possibly can because we're going to weld these together without filler metal. Well, there you go. The picture frame is done. Now, well, that was a lot of fun. And not only was it a good TIG welding challenge, you had to make some small welds without using filler metal, so it's not as hard. But it was also a test in how you fit and cut. So it starts to stretch those abilities of someone that is just starting off fabricating and doing TIG welding in their garage. Now all I got to do is just add some tabs or some brackets across here to hold the picture in. Who knows, that's the fun part about building things is you can use your imagination. Hey guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed our video, like, comment, and subscribe. If you wanna see what we're doing or see what we're up to, we're also on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. Thanks so much.